If you'll turn now to page 22, we are going to look at the theme tonight of justice. Making a difference. You shall not oppress your neighbor. You shall love your neighbor as you love yourself. When a stranger resides with you in your land, you shall not wrong him. You must judge your neighbor justly. Do not stand idly by the blood of your neighbor. Making up for the unfairness of life. Life can be very unfair. Good deeds often go unappreciated. Misdeeds go unpunished. Good people suffer while others prosper. Sensible choices often look so plain, and destructive choices seem so attractive. Healthy discipline is hard, and harmful pleasure is seductive. When we think that we are finally in control of our lives, some unwelcome surprise reminds us that we are not. Illness, tragedy, and death occur at any time. Aging often confronts us just when we are best able to enjoy the fruits of our labor. What should our response be to this unfairness? Since the fates are unjust, we have to make up for it. Only we can bring some order and meaning into this moral chaos. In defiance of an uncaring destiny, we shall strive to be fair. In the face of an indifferent universe, we shall work to be just. And when there is suffering, we will bring kindness. In the spirit of this call for justice, let's turn to page 43 and sing the song, O Devo. We resolve to accept them both and 
so a firm wall of life. May the taste of this wine upon our lips stir within us a reverence for nature, a respect for human endeavor, and an acceptance of the fullness of life. Say together, Barokim Hakaim Balaam, precious is the life within the world. Barokim Hakaim Balaam, precious is the life within us. Barokim and no praise be to God. Praise to those who bring forth the fruit of the life. in our common humanity, sharing the fruits of our labor. We cherish that which has been created through the human effort, for it is through the work of our hands, the strength of the human spirit, and the vision of our minds that our dreams are woven into the tapestry of time. We celebrate the accomplishments of yesterday and today, anticipating the possibilities of tomorrow. May the sharing of this hollow strengthen our bonds with others who walk upon this earth. Taking bread on Shabbat, remember the hungry. As we enjoy this food, thankful for health and security, we are deeply aware of the needs of all people to share in the earth's bounty. Page 37, Baruch, Matnach, 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 is the gift of food. Baruch Amal Kadmeinu, blessed is the work of our hands. Baruch Lachem Ha'aretz, blessed is the bread of the earth. Baruch Amin Ha'amosi, Lachem Amin Ha'aretz, blessed are those who bring forth bread from the earth. Thank you. 